Okay. So I decided to make this video real quick. If y'all hear that in the background, that's my game. I'm addicted to I can't stop playing it. So I let it run in the background while I'm making this video. So basically, it's a new do who you moment. And let me turn this on. Okay, so basically what I wanted to do was review this hair. But this hair with the closure. Can you see it? I don't know if you can see it. With the closure, I did not feel like setting up my tripod and none of that. I just set it on my shelf and called it a day. And plus, I'm supposed to be taking pictures in a little bit. So, I had to kind of rush to make this video. So basically what I have in my head is the 24 inch Kinky Curly and a 20 inch closure. I had to think real quick. So basically I got this hair from Ruhu. Ruhu um, is a vendor on AliExpress. And um, I bought this hair like March of last year. March maybe. Yeah, around March. And I've been wearing this hair ever since. And I recently got it installed into a wig. So this is actually a wig that I'm wearing. And ooh, child. I didn't even lay my baby hair down. But um my stylist, if you look at my old oh, my um um the video the A Phi A Alpha Phi Alpha um fraternity pageant I did, this is the same exact hair that I wore. Um I've reviewed this hair once before, but when I was at work the other day, a lot of the ladies were giving me compliments and they wanted to know where I got the hair from and they wanted me to send them links and stuff, so I said let me just go ahead and make a video. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm making a video and I'm um, just talking about it while I'm looking snackable. <laughs> and um, so this hair is a lot of maintenance. I'm trying to think and think on my feet at the same time. So this hair is a lot, a lot, a lot of maintenance. I just got out of the shower, an hour long shower of washing this hair because when I don't have to go to work or like I'm not rushing off to somewhere I would I rather wet my hair in the shower because I could just throw it all back and just take it in parts and wet it while I comb it it's so much easier to like wet your hair and comb it at the same time I don't necessarily I have a spray bottle but that's just really for the top for the closure um the best the best advice I can get is don't comb your hair while it's dry or even partially dry. I know some people do do that, but this hair, yesterday I was just fiddling with it. Didn't even realize, like, you know, it's dry, but I'm just, like, doing this because, you know, I just like touching it. And when I walked into my room yesterday from being out after doing that, I was like, I was like, Hold on, y'all. When I say this game is addictive, I was like, oh my gosh. My hair was like, whoop. And I, I wanted to take like one picture before I went to bed on Snapchat. So I was like, oh, I did. I was like, I had pulled the hair back and I had took a picture like this. So <laughs> some people didn't see how huge the hair had got. It was like, whoop. And so um, every night I just do it into like, a, like maybe three to six big twists. I just twist it, twist it, twist it all the way down to the end and all the way around. And in the morning, I wet my hair in sections if I'm not in the shower. So I'll just dip it into the sink, wet it, wet it, wet it as far as I can go, like probably right up to here. And then start from the bottom, comb up. It's gonna be a lot of, <sighs> so if you decide to get this hair glued in, baby girl it may not last because you're, you're going to be tugging a lot on the hair to get the knots out because it is curly hair and you know when you sleep the hair is going to um although it's twisted and it's more you know what's the word manageable it is still going to get a little bit natted just a little bit so that's why you wet it every day to give it back that life um right now it is currently um still wet this is the products that I use. This is my spray bottle. I don't put a lot in there because again, I only use it for the top. Sorry, 
started going back and forth. I used this. The sun is like really bright and I couldn't get my white exposure down. So let's see if you can kind of, I gotta get up in the camera so y'all can really see. So I use Auntie Jackie's Don't Shrink. I've been using this since I bought this hair and I use a lot of it all the time. Like at first I used to just use a little bit on the ends to make sure they stay like the coils at the end. But now I just use it through the whole head because I like having big hair, but not a lot, a lot. So now I use it all throughout the hair to give it, give it that, what is it, like the mix slash Puerto Rican vibe. Like, you know, the coils, how it looks right now is from Aunt Jackie's Don't Shrink. So it's, yeah, it's for natural curls, coils, and waves. So that's exactly why, like this is, uh, y'all still can't see. Okay, there we go. This is how much I've been using this hair. I kept it in the first time for like a month and a half. And then now I'm using it again. And it's a lot in this jar. It's, it's 15 ounces of whatever that mixture is. Um, then I also use Cantu's. Cantu's leave-in conditioner. I start with the, the leave-in conditioner. So after I get done wetting it all, and then I, I like to do a little thing where I just like get the water out by doing this and kind of like releasing some of the water. And then I put first the leave-in conditioner, Cantu. Use whatever conditioner you want. I, I just use Cantu because I've heard so many good things about Cantu on, on natural growth. And this hair, you have to treat like natural hair. So I use the natural hair leave-in conditioner cream. And um, again, I've been using this hair for a long time and it's like really still a lot left in here after I don't even know how many washes. These are my two go-to products for this hair plus water. Just trying to put it back real quick. Now for my, my right now my closure is sewn down and it's like, it's a wig, so the wig is just holding. But for my edges, I'm about to use, the, my tips keep coming out. I'm about to change the dress. My go-to handy dandy, of course, got to be glue for my edges of the closure. And mm, mm, I'm trying to think what else I do. Cause some people really be needing to know like the maintenance of hairs before they buy it. Now understand, can you see? This is 24 inches of kinky curly. It's a lot of maintenance the longer it gets. People have 10 inch kinky curly bobs and that's nothing. And people think, oh, she it only takes her 10 minutes to do her hair. And they think they can go out and get 22 inches, 20 inches, 30 inches of kinky curly and this is gonna be like the easiest thing in the world when it's not this hair takes time that's why if you don't have the the commitment to keep your hair looking nice and <laughs> you know in it's good natural state of how you bought it don't get the hair oh this is one last product i use you can't really see it but it's called oil free for natural hair again i use everything for natural hair i use this I use this as on my, my actual hair, my wig, and my tracks. Any and all tracks I have. And I forgot to put some on, so I'm like, I don't spray it directly on here. I spray it on my hands. I do this. Grab the hair. Do a little one, two, three, four. And then wipe it off on my hands. So basically, what that does is keeps the shine to your hair. You don't have to do that. I don't do that that spray thing every day, but I do it like when I see my hair is looking dull, I'll just do a one two shine on it, make it look nice and cute and neat. Um, I don't know, guys. I don't really know. I think this hair was one hundred and eighteen dollars, not including the closure. I bought the the hair, the three bundles from Ruhu, but I bought the closure um, from a vent uh, from. Uh, beauty supply store because I didn't know that I was going to turn it into a wig until like a month ago and 
I ordered the hair off mine, but they're taking too long. And I wanted this hair before I went home. So I can come back like new dude who you. Um, yeah, my hair looks so long in this video. But I want to just not even edit this and go sh put it straight on YouTube. Because I've been missing in action on my YouTube page. So I want to go ahead and lay this down. Get ready for my date with my co-worker at work yes honey i put this hair and went to work and the next day my co-worker's like oh my god can i take you out i was like yes honey yes you can because that's why i got this hair to let y'all know <laughs> i'm available <laughs> i don't know but yes that's all i have for you guys i know this white balance is like i look really really like probably like sunbeat because this is just throwing me off. I'm looking at myself and it's throwing me off. What else do I have to tell you guys about this hair? $118, all 24 inches and a 20 part closure. The maintenance, oh, this is how much, well, some of it I had to throw away because it, it was on the shower floor and I wasn't gonna touch it. But this is how much was in my comb. So this is like an average of how much shedding I get when I actually like wet the whole thing and comb through it and it's really soft but um yeah you're gonna see a lot of shedding you're gonna see a lot of hair everywhere 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 all oh. it took me 20 minutes to clean up the bathroom afterwards so if you don't got time for this hair don't get this hair this hair is time 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 um I don't mind because I I've had it before and I love it I love, I, I, I used to hate curly hair, and now I love curly hair, so it's like, I, I can make time for this hair. Um, let me get out of here, because I think I'm about to change this dress. I think this dress is very sexy, but my titties keep coming out, and he don't need the goods yet. He can't, he can't get the goods yet. It's just the first date, you feel me? You feel me? <laughs> you feel me? You feel me? Oh, look how it look. Oh, look, look. Look how defined it look. Okay, let me get up out of here. Until, let me back up, because I always be talking to the camera. Until next time, Jules. Peace out.